Hello everybody and welcome back to Mr. P channel. I already done a video where I was testing how Vortex performs on your phone while, while you connect it at home to your Wi-Fi and when you're out and about. And in this video, let's test Parsec, um, cloud Parsec game streaming service. When your gaming PC at home does all the hard work and streams your game to your Android device, this is Note 4 and we're going to test how this uh, Victor ran how this game performs on my Note 4 while it's been um, streamed and rendered and everything at home and streamed all the way to my on my Note 4 while, while I'm using the Moga Power Pro controller to control this game and this Note 4 um, don't have a, a SIM card so it's getting a Ethernet by I tethered this phone to this phone the S8 Plus is acting as a hotspot and Note 4 is getting internet from this phone. So let's test this out. So I have my Note 4 and I have my Moga Power Pro controller. So let me turn the controller on. So controller is turning on. As you can see, the light is flashing. So as soon as light stops flashing, I got the solid blue color. Let's open Parsec. So Parsec, Parsec is opening and let's choose my gaming computer. This Note 4 currently don't have a SIM card so it's getting broadband or getting Ethan internet from my S8 which I'm using to record. So S8 is currently acting as a hotspot, as a tethering. And I connect it straight into my computer where I already run a Steam Big Picture mode before I left my house. So every time I'm connecting, it's automatically connects to big picture mode. So if I'll go to my library and let's go for something easy to play. Let's, I don't know, let's choose, um, let's choose a Victor Ryan. Press A on a controller, press A again and A again. So right now it's opening Victor Ryan. Once in a while, it's these glitches. I don't know why it's happening. Even at home on my computer, I'm getting this sort of, uh, sort of uh, glitches. But right now, Victor Run is running at home on my gaming PC and is being streamed to my Note 4. So let's let's see how it works. So the jump button is A. So one, hold on, let you see. One, two, three, jump. One, two, three, jump. It's a bit of delay, a bit of lag, yes. So uh, let me somehow try to play one-handed. So, okay. Uh, as you can see, I hope you can see the quality on the screen. Uh, it's, it's okay to play. It's okay to play uh, minor games. If you want to play something very action-driven, <clears throat> like, I don't know, Call of Duty... Or, or a racing game, it's it's not ideal. It's still uh, a little latency happens once in a while, and it's it ruins the gameplay. But actual easy games like like Victor Ran is is alright. Again, let's do a jump test. One, two, three, jump. As you as you saw, it's it's a bit of latency. I can't measure ev all this latency, but as you can see, it, it is it is it is there. One, two, three, jump. It's, I don't know, fourth of a second, third of a second, maybe less, maybe about like 100 something milliseconds delay. Uh, the game is runs perfectly, well, re um, quality, let me grab my uh, Note 4, and uh, so as you can see, uh, quality, it's no pixelated, nothing, the quality is alright, the quality is okay. And it's playable, it's playable, it's playable, no problem. Again, if you have something like a, something like this for your, for your controller, you can use this cradle to insert your phone. And then you hold like this and you have a screen in front of you and you can do big gaming. But this, uh, this option or this, this way to play your games when you're out and about using Parsec, it's okay. It's 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 decent. It, again, don't expect to play very high 
action driven games it's gonna be a laggy but it, the game is playable the game is playable I'm just gonna quickly have a look if I have a ways to test my speed do I have my speed testing app on here no I don't so two seconds let me download one so I have a speed testing app downloaded so press open let's see how much I'm getting on this note 4 while it's connected to my s8 plus as a hotspot so finding a server press begin so let's see so testing ping and I'm getting okay I'm getting 20 plus okay 25 plus okay around 24 25 so 25.98 so nearly 26 so that's the speed that my note for getting when it's tethered to my s8 plus so close that let's go back to parsec so put the phone in the landscape press connect and it's connecting again to my gaming PC and I jump straight in the game so press start okay so yeah the games game working obviously like I mentioned before numerous times don't expect something very high quality gaming and the jumping again let's test the jumping so one two three jump <laughs> it's it stop for a second so uh Yes, yes. So if you if you own a decent gaming PC but and you want to play games everywhere where you go, Parsec is your solution. Thank you very much for watching and I'll see you next episode. Bye bye.